If you carry on watching to the end of this video, you will see the bonus product that I will be using that is easy for you to obtain that you can use to moisturize your hair either in a protective style or just in its natural state. I'm back I'm excited to be back first video of 2023 so right guys you asked for it on the poll that I did last week I asked you what video would you prefer to see and the majority of you suggested I believe it's 53% asked for me to show how I keep my natural hair moisturized in a protective style and I'm going to be showing you the products I use today so this is not a tutorial as you can see my hair is quite fluffy and that is due to the moisture because when I've worn my hair in a protective style it stayed very very neat for a very long time because I wasn't moisturizing it as I should however I have been doing that so my hair is fluffy my hair is due to be coming out today as I said so I'm just gonna jump straight into it and show you the products okay so here I have guys the as I am a restore and repair Jamaican black castor oil water and I have done a dedicated video to this not sponsored by the way but I've done a dedicated video which you can click on to at the end of this video in my reel that I showed you last week I just spritz it throughout the lengths of my hair so I start with my scalp and I follow through to near enough where I know my hair stops which would be around here every other day obviously that's why my hair's been so fluffy so I've needed to keep my hair moisturized hence why I spritz it every other day because I've had this styling for now four weeks five weeks maybe it's, it's been a while right so once that's done guys I just carry on the process I don't let it sit or anything and then I go on to my dark and lovely Amla Legend Rejuvenating Ritual. That's what it's called. Billion Hair Potion. It says it helps hair look fuller, feel thicker and acts from the roots. Now, as you can see, I picked this up thinking it was an oil. I just wanted to try something different. And to my delightful surprise, <laughs> I realized it was a liquid. So it drips out just like water. It smells absolutely divine. It smells almost like a body lotion. So let me just read to you what it says on here. So it says, what is the Billion Hair Potion? Oh my gosh, this is why I need my glasses. See how small that writing is? It says, a new generation of fortifying serum enriched with rejuvenating Indian amla oil. Its formula intensely refills the scalp in moisture to promote healthier growing hair. So now it's telling you how to use it. On dry hair, apply directly onto the scalp with the nozzle and massage gently, especially on the area where the hair is weaker. Do not rinse. But as I mentioned in the previous video where I was suffering from hair thinning or I noticed my hair is weaker and a bit more sparse in certain areas, especially like here as I mentioned. It's not so much now, it's getting back to how it was. But I do put this on my scalp as I showed you in my reel. It is very runny guys, as I said it's not an oil. And I do massage it through my hair as I'm demonstrating in my reel. So for the final part of moisturising my hair in a protective style, I have my hair grease. That's Kokata hair grease and it says for dry scalp. I don't apply this to my scalp. I literally just put it on my hair and just smooth it down the strands. And I just go up to where, as I said, like I did with the spray, I go up to where I know my actual hair stops. If you have now reached this part of the video, congratulations. I am now going to be showing you the bonus product that I've been using. <sighs> the bonus product that I moisturize my hair with is in this cup. I've made rosemary and thyme tea and I've been drinking it for a while. Thyme is good for headaches, thyme is good for reducing mucus, thyme is good for hair follicles, it's an antioxidant, it's an anti-inflammatory and rosemary also has a similar effect. So rosemary has been used for many many years to reduce hair thinning and even hair loss in men and women. So simple to make as you see in my teapot. All I have is the fresh rosemary thyme and I've bought this from Aldi. Rinse them off thoroughly, put them in my filter of my teapot thanks mom then I just put the boiling water on the herbs have a little tea and in the meantime I'll let it cool down now you can use it whilst it's warm or you can use it whilst it's cold you can spritz your hair with it if you like the scent and it's got a very nice mild herby scent to it but I prefer to do it in my hair when I'm washing my hair so if I'm going to wash my hair I use a shampoo conditioner and then I'll do a rosemary and thyme rinse and that is your bonus product Hold on guys, before you go, there is more. Don't forget to like and subscribe. If you do want to see how to use the Jamaican black castor oil water, I have done a dedicated video, which you can click on now.